All right, my friends, welcome back to Frog Boy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew, and today we are doing another upgrade for the channel. So, if you guys like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. Now, I do invest a, a pretty good amount of money, so I would really appreciate it if you would subscribe. Only 75% of you guys that actually watch the content are subscribed. And that's, I mean, I'm not going to say it's disappointing. I'm grateful that you guys watch, but I would like it if you guys would subscribe, man. That would really help me out. So, today is what we're doing is we actually went and got a new camera. So, my wife likes the camera that we got now so i went and i got the e the sony zv e10 i went and got the e10 i like the camera i love i dude i love the quality of this sony um zv one f that i'm actually using right now so i was like you know what let's do this i was actually looking at something today you know at one of these at the sony cameras because i was like man i kind of want one that will do 4k 120 or 4K one or 4K 60, but you know what, guys? Honestly, for these talking head videos, I kind of feel like 30 frames a second in 4K is more than perfect, and I can also do like 1080p 60. And the quality of that video compared to any other camera that I got, my phone camera, my freaking you know the the, the Logitech Brio, this is just incredible. So here is this. You get some papers with this bad boy. Um, the reason why I went with the Sony ZV E10. Um, I actually got the kit. So if you get the kit, then you will actually get a lens with it. So let's go ahead and take this stuff out of the bag. We got we got all of our stuff in here. And this one here, just this just feels a little bit more premium of an experience. So this camera right here today, actually, I think I got it for what? Like $7.99. It was on sale for like $7.99 or something. Actually, I don't know if it was on sale. That might be the, the freaking price. But this one here, the box is a little bit bigger than the than the other one we just got. We just got the uh, you know, I'm obviously, you know, you got a bigger box for, for this camera. Um and the other day, I, I don't know what I did with the box. Oh, here it is. But I actually got this Rode, this Rode mic, shotgun mic on there. Um, it's already on the ZV-1F. I was going to do a video, a separate video for that, but we'll do that with this right here. This is the Rode mic. This cost $100. Well, here's the funny thing, guys. I went back to Best Buy to get a, a shotgun mic, and the camera that I just bought, the Sony ZV-1F, went, went down 100 bucks. So I was able to get my 100 bucks back and and get that Rode mic for the same price. So that's actually a good deal. If you're looking for a Sony ZV-1F, I would hurry up and go to Best Buy right now, pick that up with the Rode mic, and you are freaking set. This mic is awesome. So let's go ahead and start looking at this. Now I was sitting there and I was holding it over there at Best Buy. And this one here, it's, it's a little bit bigger than the Sony ZV-1F, but you get this extra lens. You get this extra lens with it, which is freaking awesome. So you'll be able to zoom in and stuff a little bit more. Obviously, it's got the same flip out freaking uh, thing. This one here, you turn on just a little bit differently. Um, but I've actually got to put a battery in there. <laughs> so this one here does come with a battery. So we got the battery. Uh, we'll go ahead and stick that bad boy in there. I actually got a memory card for it too. We'll go ahead and stick that in there as well. So battery goes in just like this. Click that down. You'll see the little purple tab in there that will lock that down in place. We'll go ahead and set the camera upside down. Uh, this time I got like a regular standard size memory card. Last time I did not know what I actually needed. So this time I actually got one. Uh, the freaking guy Oliver over at Best Buy is actually incredibly cool. He knew his stuff. I felt very comfortable purchasing this camera. You know, because he actually knew his camera stuff. I was actually looking at like a Panasonic too. Uh, but I think I think I like the Sony's man. I, I do. Like these Sony's are they're awesome and they're like these function these these settings and stuff for beginners that these Sony cameras have. I'm sorry, dude, I'm so uncoordinated today, my friends. I'm so happy you can you can just hear the excitement in my voice as I tear through this hard plastic. I'm literally cutting this open with a, I don't even know why I got a tile drill on my desk right now, but I do, I, I, I do. I have a tile freaking drill 
on my desk. I think it was because I was drilling tile a couple weeks ago and I just didn't haven't put it back in my toolbox just yet, but I will eventually. So let's go ahead and stick this bad boy in there. It's a good thing it won't let you just cram it in there however which way you want. So now we've got both of those. You got to pull that. All right. So yes, let's see. Let's turn this on for the very first time. And there's boom on. Wow. Battery is completely, completely, completely not alive. So is what we'll do is we'll run a USB cable to that while we're talking about this, talking about some of these cool features. We'll, we'll get some power going to it. Now I believe this thing is HD or... Okay, no, this is not USB-C. Yeah, it is, it's right there. I'm just not very smart. It looked different, like it looked weird for a second. So if you look under here, it should tell me that it's, it is charging. Yep, it is charging. This one here feels a little bit heavier than the ZV-1F, but let's go ahead and check out some of this other stuff that I got while that's charging up a little bit. I got the battery charger so I can just stick it into the wall um, and charge up my, my second battery. This is gonna help me tremendously because I do wanna do a lot of these videos at 4k I, I want to do some of these talking head videos at 4k so this gives me the ability to have a backup battery right there charging because the other day when i was doing a video i was doing the uh the build video the whole reason i bought one of these cameras is i was doing the build video for the uh, uh and this is an extra battery the battery size for this is gonna be you gotta you gotta check these too because i almost bought the same battery for that it's the uh, np fw 50s so if you get the NWFP50s, I'm kind of going to see if maybe I can get like a dummy battery for this one to see if I can just keep it consistently going for the whole time. I want to see what we can do um, for, for this. So we've got the extra battery. We'll just plug that right into the charger and then we'll go ahead and flip that flip that on. So, okay, let's go ahead and turn this bad boy on. Like this does come with the little... Oh, it comes with an actual freaking charger. I did not get that with the Sony ZV-1F. I don't think I got like a little brick that you can charge. So you can you can have this plugged in with the USB cable. That's freaking pretty cool. Pretty freaking cool. So let me go ahead and set this bad boy down because you get this freaking nice strap with this one. I did not get a strap with the other one. This is going to be freaking awesome, man. I like, I like this. I like this a lot. So... Yeah, so you just kind of go in here. I'm assuming. And then up through here and back through here. Just like a regular slipper. Yep, nice little slipper. Okay, and then on the other side, we'll leave it so that we can see the Sony strap coming out the back, the Sony name tag. See guys, I'm not I'm not against Sony. I love Sony. I mean, I could have bought a Canon or something else, but I love Sony. I think Sony's a good company. I mean, dude, I'm blown away with this freaking Sony ZV-1F. So, I mean, if you're a content creator, man, and you're looking for freaking good cameras, like, look at that. Boom. You got a nice little strap with that thing, so you can just hold it like that. You can walk around. You could take pictures. I mean, dude, imagine Frog Boy, the photographer. Froggy! So this one here actually has like the zoomer, the zoomer thing on there. What is that? Wide. So you got like wide and you can, oh, you can do the digital zoom too with this. That it looks like, ooh. You could take that off completely so you can swap out different. Oh man, look there. It's got some nice stuff. I don't think I have the, product thing on there so i gotta cover my eyes or something but let's see so and then it's like a little white dot for putting it back on yeah and then it clicks clicks into place dude that is freaking cool so let's go ahead and turn it on now there should be at least a second of battery on there okay so i guess i can show you guys the setup thing on here we're gonna go ahead and 
set it up. So we're going to do English. Wait, does this one not have a touch screen? Enter. I'm all the way over in here somewhere. Wow, gosh. Okay, I'm in the Denver time zone. So, daylight savings off. Date and time. So, and then you can do this, this like little thing right there with your phone so you can get into the app or whatever. And then it will, it will, it will, it will let you set it up. Okay. Dude, I keep going to push that. Could not recover image database due to battery dying. Oh, I don't want to. Yeah, this one does not have a. So we're going to let this one charge for a minute, but yeah, dude, there's the unboxing. Like, look at this camera, man. This thing is freaking beautiful. It's nice. It's got some freaking heft to it. This one here actually feels definitely more premium than the Sony ZV-1F. I, that kind of sucks. If this doesn't have a touch screen, I'm going to freak out, but it says it's the Sony ZV-1F 4K. This is cool, man. So I'll do a bunch of videos. I'll do a bunch of stuff. I'll, I'll check this out. Um, I don't necessarily mind too much if it doesn't have a touch screen for this because obviously it's going to be sitting on the tripod while I make videos and stuff. So that's not going to be that big of a deal. But yeah, that, that is pretty cool. I've <clears throat> added this here to the, uh, to the collection of things. So yeah i'm excited about that so if you guys like this content like i said don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, i'll get you guys some video with this i'll actually film the next video with this camera so all right guys we'll see you guys in the next one